Hello, hello. My name is Perfectly Balanced. And I am Aetherbeat. And what a show we have prepared for you today. You know, we had 128 men uh, men in the bracket here for Guilty Gear Exerd. And out of those 128 people, six of them made it here to the finals. And we are going to be seeing them here today, battling it out to see who prevails for this bracket here at EVO. Yeah, no, it's been such a wonderful day here at EVO. Uh, it's been so hype seeing so many matches and getting to see so many people come from all over the world, like Kadako's from Japan. We have plenty of people from the uh, East Coast. Crocs and Socks is going to be in the bracket representing the East Coast. We got Fu coming uh, in from SoCal. We have uh, Daymendo uh, up at bat currently repping NorCal. Yep. And uh, then we have Why Not also from SoCal and yep. Peppery Splash also repping uh, East Coast. Yep. That's what we got coming up. And right now we got Kadako, yep, facing off against Damon Doe. It's going to be May versus Slayer. And these two are no stranger to this matchup. But Kadako coming here all the way from Japan. Yeah. Um, formerly known as one of the best Mays in the world. Possibly the best May in the world. Yeah, I mean, still fighting for it. Yep, trying to reclaim his throne. Uh, and then Damon Doe, you know, also no, no stranger to the stage. You know, one of the best Slayers we've got. Yeah. Best Slayer in the West Coast. Uh, arguably best slayer in the country. Yeah. Um, Though, we must admit, Crocs, Crocs is the one who knocked him in the losers. Yep. Got to uh, gotta give credit where credit is due. Crocs knocked him in the losers, and those two have been kind of scuffing it out Yeah. Uh, for the throne. Crocs coming from East Coast, Draymond Doe coming from West Coast. So we're going to see who comes out on top here. Yeah. Um, something so interesting about those two players is they represent such different styles. Yep. Draymond Doe is... At the end of the day, he's playing a, a wild character. He kind of has to be, but he's still very slow and very methodical. And he, mm -hmm. wants, he wants to kind of grind the game in a Slayer sort of way. While Crocs is, I'm going to go pedal to the metal. I am going to hit you, and it's going to hurt. Yep. And uh, so Kodako, he is renowned in his combo game. Oh, yeah. There is no May who has a punch game like Kodako. Yeah. He is known for uh, really pushing May's combo game to its peak. You know, she has some combos where she kind of loops, uh, like 2-H in the vertical dolphin. It's yeah. like a number. You know, most Mays only go for, like, 2, 1 or 2. This man finds the max number he can do on each character. And it's like, you can do 4 on this character. You can do 3. He says 3.5 on this character. I don't even know what a half means. But he, he has all the that. He does it in plus R and in extra. Yeah, almost certainly. But, yeah, so it's going to be wild to see how these two throw down. Um, and let's look we're going into it right now. Yep. And a lot of these matches that we've seen over the day have been really close, so I'm super excited to see the, the matches on display here at top, at top six for here at EVO. Yep. But all right, I think we're getting right into it. Starting things off here at EVO top six yep. with Daymendo Slayer versus uh, Kadako on May. All right, and we're starting off. Kadaka does a super jump JS. They're, they're keeping some pretty non Camille neutral. Oh, yeah. Definitely want to try to take advantage of all the great air normals that May has. Yep. But now has the Dolphin set up with the 6P from Slayer. 6P. You don't want to get counter hit by that. It's a wall bounce from anywhere on the screen. Caught with the overhead. Damendo's got a knockdown. Oh, but gold burst. burst from Kadako. And the ball. If that ball hits counter hit, you are in full tech. May's doing a combo no matter where you are. Yep. All right, the Blitz and. Bates out the blitz back with the six delays on the 6K. Oh my gosh, the quadruple cross up? Yeah, you do not know what side this is gonna hit on. Tries to take back the corner for Damendo. Yep, okay. You saw Damendo kind of held back because he kind of felt that Kadaku was gonna try to jump out of the corner there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yep, Dandy YRC. Man, Kadaku sitting a lot of meters, spends 25 of it. Yeah, you see Kadaku's smart use of the 2D there, has lots of active frames to catch the Slayer dash. All right, and Demendo trying to jail Kadako here in this corner. Gets the throw. The throw. Taking the first round. All right, good start here. And Kadako basically has his full burst back. Oh, my gosh. And that's a counter hit. Yeah, you don't want to get hit by that. Takes the first point. Okay, good IVs. No punish, though. All right, the jab from Demendo manages to steal his turn. Yep. Oh, and the J2H. And the Kadako trying to be safe. Just back dash away, trying to create a whiff. Yeah, now, nice 2D. Gets the party started. K8. Okay, the Street Fighter Anti-Air 5P. <laughs> oh, okay, I'm surprised that 6P didn't go through the burst, but Demendo's still trying to maintain a core position here. But Kadako fighting their way out. Oh, man. 
That was quite a draw. In fact, that could be very costly for Kodako. Yep, and now Daymendo has all this meter to play with. Kodako spends 25 of it. Patiently waiting, trying to oh, find the time, finds a way in. Kodako has been repping this JS very well. Oh no, the Blitz does not pay out for Daymendo. Jailing again. Good block from Kodako here. Yeah, oh my dude, goodness. Dude. But you gotta be scared for this character still has, uh, Daymendo still has 100 bar. And look at the risk. Oh! oh, oh the <laughs> biggest of hits, the trade. Yep. With paying the, in Daymendo's favor. With a risk bar like that, it was over. Yeah. The way, the way risk bar works is as long as there's any of it filled up at all, none of your hits scale. Combo, your combo will not scale. And on top of that, if it's flashing like that, until it stops flashing, every hit will be a counter hit. Yep. Every hit. <laughs> it's so much, especially Slayer, who already does so much damage. Yep. All right. But those are very close rounds, though. We'll see how Kodako comes back from that. All right. Knockdown. I think the BDC early. Yep, it's very hard to keep Slayer and Oki because his BDC gets him out of so many things. Yep. And especially in scramble scenarios where you're not quite certain who has the advantage, BDC really does help to even those odds. Yep. Or at least tip them even further into Slayer's favor. Exactly. BDC being a back dash cancel for those who don't know. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, but the big counter hit for Kadako. Yeah, May, uh, Kadaku's doing a lot of JS here to control the neutral. Oh, big counter hit. Misses the confirm, though. And Senga like that? Is that how you feel? But clip with a 6 8 for Daymendo, but the backdash the is back going to beat that by. The 2D may have an incredibly good backdash. One of like top five in the game, I think. Most and certainly. 2D, lots of active frames, only minus one on block. Very good against Slayer. Yeah, and, and relatively quick for 2Ds. Yes. And low profile. Yeah. Okay, but Daymendo's got the corner position here, but Kadako trying to super jump out, but Daymendo ready, backs off, tries to maintain the corner position. Daymendo has been really good at dodging all these J2H. Did you see this? Yeah. I don't think he's been hit by a single one. But he's going to get hit by a 6H. Just knocked oh. into the corner. Here comes the oh, Dolphins. Oh, right. You said he got hit by two. Yes, indeed. And we've been talking about Slayer damage, but we cannot overlook May damage. Oh. All right. Finds a way out. Goes through the super. Get the fight. All right. Mappa going to seal the deal. Gets a counter hit, too. All right. Daymendo now on set point. Yes, and they both have burst. And reminder, folks, that because this is top six, this is a loser's match. Loser here goes home. Yep. This is the first of two right now. Oh, oh the big counter hit. Counter hit JS. Oh, wow. Right at the last second. All right. It takes the blitz. Gets 6K and oh, the fight loops. Man, he gets so much health back from that. Okay, burst. Not a gold burst, though. Must have missed the window. But it's going to come down with a vertical dolphin. And base the Blitz out that time. Daymendo has been representing Blitz uh, in these uh, scramble scenarios a little too much. Yep, and you can see Kadako's combo proficiency there. Squeezing every little bit of damage he can out of those confirms. Every little bit. From a regular throw, he did like 40% of his health. Yep. And keep in mind, regular throw, I think, brings you down to like, I think 60% scaling or something like something that. Something like that. So he did all of that with 60% scaling at the start. Daymendo taking that time because now it's one to one. Yep. This could be. This, this will be last game. And it was. Both of these games are close, but you want to know why it swung from slightly your favor to slightly their favor. You want to yeah. make sure you can identify it. All right. Okay. Yep. Dodging the JS this time. That JS was doing a lot of work. But uh, player has incredibly good anti air. He's got him with the crosswise there. Yep. And yeah, just with the Blitz, could not really commit to any other, like, any of their trickers. Commits to Blitz to try and beat the, come right. down with the button. Okay, take the first one. And you see Kadaku trying to keep him at bay with the 2D. Oh, oh no, this is the throw! Too early, especially if he got the hit. Yeah, and Daymendo trying to go for a reset of their own, get their own command throw. Oh man, it's gonna be a wall splat. Goes oh, for the no! tech trap! All right, no, not a big confirm. Get knocked down. Overhead, not going to be much damage from that. Oh, okay, trade. Oh, yeah. was it a trade? Okay. Here oh. comes the overhead kiss. No, this, this. It's going to be, wow. Oh, what? Yeah, there it is. I don't see any mate do that combo like that, except for Kadaka. <laughs> Man, you are not kidding when this, car uh, this player has such incredibly interesting confirms. Okay, Kadaka on set point now. Yeah. 
man. And he, they were trying to get a hit, but Kadako's just dancing in the air. Yeah, the movement from both these players. You, you see Kadako in the air, and you see uh, Damendo on the ground. Yep. Oh my but goodness. The vertical dolphin. Look at this combo. And takes the first point. Okay, now Ball is out, controlling the neutral from May. He's got the overhead. Okay. He's out of there always, but he's, but he's not. He's out of the frying pan and into the oil. Oh, man. Now, he does have 50 meter. He could. Okay, there it is. Yeah, this is still doable. Yep, and... Oh, my Blitz goodness! the goal burst! This is the robbery he needed! All right, simple He's, knockdown. Oh, Hit him with the unblockable. Oh, back dash. He knows... Oh, my gosh. This but, is a combo. Is he dead? No, you got one more one mix more, up. One more. But hit him with the take and, and reset with the oh throw. We are goodness. final, final. Final, final round. Both players on set point. Turn up the heat. Okay, okay. gets the dolphin. Is he got a goal on it? Nope. Ball instead. Yeah, Kadako now just doesn't want to get scrambled by a, mm. by a Slayer trying to back off, but now he's getting hit by a big counter hit. Okay, Pete, uh, Damon misses the last hit, but still safe. Keep Kadako in the corner. Clip with it's, another blitz. Oh, man. This is going to be a knockdown. It's, oh, look for a reset. All right, simple knockdown. PRC, try to be safe, but it's still getting a clip. Maybe try to 6P or something. It is, oh my gosh, bite like that. It is getting dangerously low for both players. The next couple hits are gonna do it. Yeah, we don't have a lot of life to spend this burst. We have to look to spend it aggressively or spend it the moment we get hit. Oh man, Kadako is tensing that Damado is not comfortable with how he's dealing with the air. Yep. Oh, but clip of the cross flies. flies. All right, one more. Okay, OTG burst. Okay, yeah. BTC's into the ball. Damon with 50 meter. Okay, one more mix up. Gets the, the blitz. And oh, Kadako expecting the blitz back just runs up with the command throw. Try oh. Damon didn't burst. Oh no, he's oh, coming man. up and doesn't have the opportunity he, to burst. Yep, the blitz took out. That was the most unfortunate thing for him because the blitz took out the burst. We couldn't burst at the end there. That was so unfortunate. Or and very smart from Kadako there to do it like that. Yeah. And like he ran because he ran up what it seemed like mid blitz, and uh, Slay or Damendo woke up with 2K, but he charged it just that tiny bit to get the all guard. Yep. And beat out the 2K. Yeah, if you're a little too late, the blitz switches from whatever direction you chose to projecting both directions. So uh, you have to be careful about that. Uh, you might have to go for the throw instead. Yeah. But wow, what a crazy set! So Kadako going to be moving on to loser semis. And up next, we have Zwei Knotts versus Peppery Splash. Yeah, Peppery Splash in, involved in the upset of the entire tournament. Like, Moku taking out Peppery Splash, putting him into losers yeah. real early. Or, like, not early, but, like, just outside of pools. Yeah, and I think Zwei ended up there from, uh, was it Solstice? I, I'm not sure. No, but, um, but I'm not sure who it was. But in any case, uh, it's going to be Johnny versus Venom. Yep going to be a, a, a matchup that both of them are familiar with. Uh, Peppery Splash used to be a Johnny yeah. before switching to Venom, and now he's the best Venom on the Western Hemisphere. Yeah. Uh, Zwei, trying to make a name for himself, one of the best Johnnies we have, um, hailing from SoCal, yeah. and uh, also no stranger this matchup because he has a lot of sets versus both Hurt and Takanase. Yep. Both very incredibly good uh, Venoms on the West Coast. Yep. And, and Peppery's been around for a long time. Zwei is definitely part of the new guard. Yes. Definitely the new blood. Just trying to uh, bring in a new era of Guilty Gear Exert. But man. And this is going to be a, an incredibly interesting matchup. Because, like, Johnny plays such good neutral. But Venom at any point, or Venom has such good setups with the balls. Yeah. And, uh, uh, it creates such great formations that it's really kind of annoying to navigate around it. Yeah, and Johnny is something that the Connacy vets to tell me a lot about this matchup is Johnny is a tall character. Yep. So Venom can hit these balls at an awkward, like, high height that wouldn't threaten most characters, but they threaten Johnny. Yeah. Because he's tall, his dash doesn't really make him go that much lower, and they'd also cover jumps. Yep. So Venom has this interest, interesting hold on neutral against Johnny. Um, also, both of these characters don't have DPs. Nope. So whoever gets the other on their back first gets to kind of have fun. Yeah, just do whatever they want. Yep. But again, whenever, uh, yes, yeah, so, and that's going to be really important because when you're dealing with Johnny pressure, you need to find a way to escape. Yep. 
In this Especially when they got level three and they're hitting you with six H miss finer panels, six H mix finer cancel. Yep. Where Venom has the very strong uh, vortex, Johnny has damage. Oh yeah. He is going to suffocate you with mid and then he is going to kill you. Yeah, and he's gonna make you want to scramble because you see that risk H flashing. Yep. Okay, a quick burst. Doesn't want to let Johnny get started. Yeah, no, that burst point is uh, probably one of the more safer burst points, especially because you make them spend two coins. Yep. And uh, you don't have to make them get a level. Oh my goodness. Okay, got the levels. Five coins left. Yeah. Hopping to save some of the coins only goes for level two here. But level two is still strong in its own right. Ah, uh, and there it is, uh, the quick burst. Yeah, Zwei, Zwei is very infamous for like being very aggressive with their bursts. Yeah, very aggressive in general, honestly. Yeah. All right. This is where it starts, but the... Oh, he was ready for the run-up throw. Yep, and like that's not even like dash, dash, though. That's just da single dash up, and Pepper Smash is ready to the, or break the throw, yep. which is just you just throw them. Double head Morbid in. Morbid? Is that how you feel? You really want to keep him locked down. Okay. Oh, yeah. This oh. is your home. You are, you are staying Look here. at this chip. And ben Venom, one of the highest uh, damaging characters with chip in the game. Yep. Doesn't have to hit you to get his damage. Yep. Coming with a struggle from the top ropes. Break on the throw. Okay. Sly chasing him into the corner. Trying to hold him down, but these Mist Finders are only level one right now. So he is not a threat. Oh. But there's the throw. And now we're at level two. Coin, coin, and okay. spends the burst. Johnny is level two now. Yeah, still enough to get a combo. Knock only down. two coins left, and Pepper has a lot of life left still. But now we're going to get level three. Yeah. Or we could get level three. I think he wants to really hold that last coin. Yeah. You got 100 meters, though. No unblockable setup, though. Not going for the dash up 6K YRC oh and gets my. done. Dizzy. Take some of his burst. Yeah, and does some more of it. Yeah, does double bur double blitz. Really wants to take some of that burst away. Yeah. And blitz is an unscaled combo starter, so it's a very good punish option. Yeah, it's unscaled at least when you do it like max charge. Yeah. Oh, but clip on the delayed air dash blocks the burst. Happy splash. Oh my goodness! Showing, Whoa! Showing that Venom can indeed do some damage. Yep. It's not just in the Oki, it's actual combos. Yeah. Hit or block, we're still doing a lot of damage, especially with level three ball. Oh my god, Bit. Sly blocked the fuzzy, still got hit by Red Hail. And you can see Pep Freeze blocked the smile on his face. Red Hail is not a super you see very often from Venom. No, you know. If you'd like to hail as one of the worst supers in the game. But you know what, it did its work. It did the job. Yeah. And, and Sly is feeling himself. Yeah, he is trying to pump himself up. Zwei, quite an emotional player yeah. at the end of the day. So when he gets the like the emotional momentum, it, he's, it feels like an unstoppable train. Yeah. Spends oh. the YRC. Oh my god, gets the steals the corner on that one. 6k oh, YRC. Bro, he's really going in. Okay, six coins. Oh, no. Oh, and the first. Did the, one of those coins hit at least? Yeah, one of them did. Okay. So he has level two now, but Pepper is so aware of when to burst. I'm not letting you get level three. Yeah. Because if you get level three, I lose. Yeah. <laughs> you know, level it's, two, though, still doing some damage here. The yeah. cross up, good block on it. Oh, man, gets clipped by the F struggle. And the man, all of this chip damage piling up. Oh, wow. So I let him get away with the whip 2D. Very dangerous move for Venom to whip this counter hit recovery. Yeah. All right, Peppery now on set point. And this is looking like a very clean game for Peppery. Yeah, remember, loser, this goes home. So Zwei's really got to pull something out right now. Looking rough right now. Yeah. Oh, okay, wow, the shimmy. Okay, man, stuck in the corner here. You got 50 bar, you could spend dead angle. Good defense from Zwei, but it's not enough um, to get you out the next throw, though. All right, this is, a, this is the reversal he needs. Nice. Gets a throw. And now we got level three. Spend the laser beam. Ooh. Set up the unblockable. Now it's there. No, oh, but misses no. the knockdown. Oh. Okay. It's just a setup. But the unblockable's gone now. But we got Zwei RC. Peppery with the blocks, though. Oh, old reliable S Stinger. And blocks the first. 
All right, so Wise gonna get knocked down here. Level three orb. Oh man, and, and Dark Angel checkmate. No, it's not good. You're yet. gonna lose your meter. Oh my gosh, he can't get chipped anymore. He literally. Oh, oh my God! Why not? Why not? Why All right, TF not. He's feeling himself now. He's it's definitely feeling it now. And like you took his burst. You're at the burst advantage. All right, but you're gonna get thrown. But man, Peppery not dropping his combos. And trying to air IB to get some of that frame advantage and maybe try and ground throw there. So why not? Really trying to make this uh, comeback happen. Oh, but getting clip, on the, uh, or clip doing 6K. Yep. Peppery with a knockdown. Oh, oh man, gonna get thrown. Throw. Oh, you man. have one burst. You have burst. You have to use it, oh, but you can. so hard. Yeah, Pepri seeing the burst come back and is like, all right, I can make this as burst safe as yeah, possible. Venom, a character who can play around burst and dead angles very well. Oh, man. Man, that is, even though that was 2-0, that was incredibly, yeah. like a roller coaster of emotions through that match. The epitome of 2-0, but it was close though. Oh, most certainly. You could see Zwei really trying to mount a comeback. He was really, really pushing hard for that. But Peppery Splash will move forward. He has the experience, and he's going to bring him forward to loser semis. Oh, yeah, where he will fight Kadako. Yep. So I think next we are going to do uh, winner's finals, Fu versus Crocs. Yep. And these two have fought many a time. I remember, I think I commentated for them fighting before our combo breaker last year. Yeah. Uh, it was a really close set, I think, Crocs won that set to move on and fight against uh, Peppery in Grand Finals. Um, we'll see what happens here. Who comes out on top? Almost certainly. And again, wow, we have like a lot of high damage characters in this top six. We got two Slayers. We have Fu on Heihan, and we have uh, Jonathan. We had Jonathan Guilty Gear yep. played by Zwei. And we had May on. Yeah, we have, we have May. Kodako May. You know, Venom is not exactly low damage, but it's really yeah, he's low. not exactly low damage, but his damage is, uh, he doesn't do a lot on hit, but he also does so much more on block. Yeah, but compared to these Titans, he's like, oh, oh no. <laughs> compared to, uh, oh, I got clipped by uh, Heihun overhead, and now I got Shinken looped yeah. for 50% of my life. Mm -hmm. And Slayer is like, whoops, you whipped him my dandy. <laughs> have a pile of bunker. It'd be a shame if it counter hit. Yeah. Oh, you try to press a button crosswise? There's no hurt box, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right, I think we're getting right into it. Yep. Crocs representing Christmas oh. in August. What an anti-air. Okay. Slowly walk up. Good blocks. There's something that happened a lot during their previous sets is uh, Fu will test Crocs a lot on whether he can deal with uh, tick throws in that orange ball, Oki. Yeah. Yeah, orange ball hitting enough times that BDC is not necessarily a problem you really have to worry about. Yeah, he, he can't really get out. He's the bottom floor is going to be there. Uh, yep, caught him with a 6K low. He does not get a loop there, but gets a pretty good knockdown here mid-screen. Man, that's ball wire C. And with the two-piece, slowly walk up. Oh, man, he gets all that health back. <laughs> the, oh. the health he gets back from a bite at low health is not insignificant. All right, Spence, first dot. Oh my goodness, he won't die from like a, a short combo anymore. Yeah. Man. And Oh, wait, he got two combos. Yeah. And <laughs> he spent first dot, but he spent most a lot of that final round in Hellfire, so he made a, a, he made enough of it back. Yes. Croc's a known infamous for his use of burst dot. He will not burst because he really wants that damage. Oh yeah. And he wants like the easy reversal, like you don't have to BDC it, yep. you just do it. Because you can call out so many frame traps with that. But right now, Fu staying on top of the game. He's got the IVs for the meter gain. Oh yeah. And oh. this whip punish with the super. Oh wow, this JH in there. These checks with the, the Heia 2P are so powerful. It's so fast, it's so large. All right, ready for bite this time. Yeah, like, Boo, uh, Hayden's very good at just challenging any, like, type of gap you might leave. Yep, catch him with a 2P, cross him up. Oh, oh my gosh. And the patented Boo mix. Yeah. Man, 
Crocs are like so ready to block that mix-ups though. Yeah, but you can only block for so long. When when Fu is meter, it feels like you are getting eating like a dozen mix-ups yeah. in like a second. And that's like something really important to keep in mind is pay attention to Fu's meter. Yes. Fu really likes playing the resource game. Really like you see how many IBs this man does? He will IB like 75% of your hits to get that meter game. Yeah, and where a lot of people might try to IB to try and take their turn back, Fu is doing it just to build the tension pulse. Yep. And it making it easier to take his turn back is just a bonus. Yep. All right, then throw. He's ready. Oh, man. Interesting ball movement there. But Fu with this corner steal. All and right. Here it is, putting that meter to use. Yeah, and because Supers don't take your tension pulse, all the while he's getting his meter back. Look, he Look. now all nearly has 75. Yep. He can do it again if he wants. Oh, oh. he's blocking, right? Oh. No. no. Oh, oh my goodness. Maybe. Maybe. Fading a burst, maybe. Maybe. So dead on time is the interesting, interesting property of um, actually both of them have a super where plus zero after the flash. Yep. So if you're not already blocking by the time you see the super, it's over. Oh yeah. The clap ended on time. Oh man, catching the jump. Okay. Crocs with the uh, the device, keeping a lot of corner position here. Oh man, you see these IBs here. Oh man, you gotta be careful of the risk. Yeah, the thing about IB is that your risk grows higher than usual. Man, Fu with the confirm. Here's the red ball setup. Oh! oh. But Crocs is ready, sees the dad run up, and I'm gonna throw you. Man, the pilot bunker disappointed. BD, oh, DD. Oh. Ah, got him in the YRC startup. All right, it's one to one. One to one. They are going back oh, and geez. forth. And this is winner's finals. This is a first of three. Yep. So we got a, we still got plenty of game left to uh, play. Knock him down. Has the red ball up, oh, but you can't dandy through that. Nope. Ball very good at dealing with Slayer neutral, because if you have something with lots of active frames, you can catch backdash cancel, you can catch dandy. Yep. And without that much commitment from yourself. Yeah, and even better is that if you keep it like in front of him, because you can control the orange ball, you can keep it right in front of him so he can't just try to like BDC Mappa through. Yep. Oh man, but Crocs running through the 50-50s here. Yep. 50 50s, more like four ways. But Fu getting the hit out, gets the knockdown. Oh, and, but Croc throws back. He knows the throw window. All right. Is he blocking? No, no he was not. <laughs> I think he tried to 2K. Yeah, I think he, uh, yeah, that might have, been, might have been caught in recovery for... Uh, the, the orange kick with? Yeah. Oh, oh my goodness. It's a big trade. But that JD apparently hitting from the front. Foo, but still stuck ah, in the corner. 50-50 city, baby. Yeah, this is where you definitely don't want to be stuck in the corner. Okay, good block with the bite, and that's going to be a counter hit. But if you're cross, you got to worry about the burst. Okay, oh man, catches the back but doesn't really get much out of it. Oh, oh here comes the clap. my turn. A lot of damage. Run oh. up, FD, really looking for burst out on top. Oh Run my up, goodness! Oh. Control the neutral! Oh. Man, Spence. Oh. But just like That's that, Spence, all of yeah. That was a big gambit. 6-8, um, very punishable from Coom. It's a six frame, six or I think it's a six frame normal. Yeah. But it's like double digits minus, like minus 20 or something. Yeah. It's definitely one of those hard call out moves. Yeah. Oh my god, the movement at round start here represented by both players. The counter hit on the Hayabusa kick from uh, Fu. Oh, it's, it's uh, seven frames, because it, it won't beat Venom 2S. Oh, okay, seven frames. Right. Oh my god, you don't want to get clipped. Oh. Yeah, and him, uh, Croc's not really willing to bur try and burst that. He, he, yeah, he wants to save that. He wants to burst top when he can. All right, are we going to see a second ball? And man, Fu working with such a lead here. Yep. All right. Why is he so the Oh, but it doesn't matter. The perfect seven golden letters. Damn. And Fu demonstrating so much control over that uh, initial round. Oh man. Oh, oh man. There's a loop. Counter hit. Put Fu with the tech air throw. And Crocs will not let himself get tick thrown that setup. No. Oh wait. BDC Mappa, they're doing work. Oh wow. wow. Fortunate is not able to catch the back dash. Seal, seal it out with uh, DOT or dead on time. Yep. So, one round apiece. Crocs on set point, and uh, both of them have burst. Oh, yeah. But I think with Crocs, we know where it's going to be. Yeah, uh, we know where it's going. 
And one of the nice things about Slayer is that even if you're like kind of losing, you're taking a lot of damage, you're building a lot of meter, which you, you can then use to do mount you, the comeback. Do you see all these Shinkens? That's like That was like seven or eight at yeah. neutral. Yeah. So Shinken is very interesting. It's a low profile on frame one, and then the moment he kicks, it goes in bolt. Oh, yeah. So very strong neutral duel, actually. Hey. I think he's only been hitting with Shinkens, really. He's, he's, they're, they are playing neutral with their they Shinkens. Are, they are going, I have my destroyed button here, and you are going to have to deal with it. Oh, man. Hey. Is this going to... Oh, okay. I think we're spinning first, maybe. Yeah. Oh, man. Which is odd, because I think Shinken loops are naturally burst here. But Vu right. with the throw. It's, it's really hard to burst them, because, again, they're low profile frame one. Yeah. And they're low profile until she kicks when she's in bold. Yeah. So it's, it's hard. Like, 9 times of 10, if you actually do want to burst Shinken loops, you actually burst once you hit the wall. Yeah. It looks stupid, but it's actually probably the safest place to burst. Yeah, unless they hard call it out. But yeah, now it's but they need, like, 50 meter to do that. Yep. Or they just drop their combo. Two, two, a piece. And trying to get the Grandpa Viper in. Oh, man, the stare down. Oh, Shinken. Oh, this is combo. It does. It does. Get him behind the back. Clip him up. Oh, okay, no ball there. May have been a missed input, not sure. Oh no, but Crocs with the mash on the fight. Okay, the throw. And a brave throw mash at that because uh, the it's late follow-up is throwing bolt. Here comes the first dot, and Dude, that's gonna be enough. Has Fu blocked a single burst at on time? I don't think he has. Man, it's, it's like, again, it's zero after the flat. It's very hard, and Crocs is doing it in every gap where he thinks Fu is a little too committed. Yeah. Oh man, the run up 6P. Oh, the Shinken. And the duty to catch the back dash. But not aware enough. Uh, Crocs gets out of the corner. Man, Fu really is down the cl like down the scrap right now. Yeah, definitely representing the. Okay, you want to scrap? Let's uh, scrap. You want to scrap? I can fight too. Oh, I think that's might have been an infinite input. But oh, that's a good trade for Fu. Gets a knockdown, but the anti air oh, with the, the jab. Anti air. Okay, oh. the throw. Oh, 75 meter from the, uh, Crocs, though. Oh, oh, trying to set up the block, but the Crocs throws. Here comes the burst. Here super. is my burst. Oh! No way! Oh my God! I have never seen that before. There is a hit of armor with the clap super. Oh my God! Fu with oh, the throw. Oh my goodness. The 2P does not confirm though. Oh, but that one will not hit. Oh, okay, okay, blocking the overhead. The break of the Oh! We know that they one hit scenario. He has burst. Oh! He really wants to win. Oh! This the blitz. Holy shit! The blitz. The air dash blitz. Oh my goodness! I can't believe it. He didn't even. He could have air and beat it, but he didn't want to give. A chance. Yeah. He blitzed. <laughs> oh my god. And Fu didn't have the meter to blitz back. Blitz back. What a crazy game five. <laughs> Showing off the crux. Yep. Crux, crux, crux living up to his name. Is such a character. Yep. Love that guy. Oh, oh my goodness. I that I can't believe. That set was insane. It was that, that was such a good set. The 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 speed at which those two players think while it's, doing all these mix-ups. It's so <laughs> impressive. Crazy. Uh, so next up, we got um, Kodaku and Peppery Splash. Those two are going to be playing a loser semis. So we're going back to first two land. Yeah. Um, I still can't believe there's still more gear to be played. Yep. But there is still more There's gear still to be more. played. Even after that, that that set was crazy enough. It could have been the grand finals of, it, a, of a major somewhere, but that was only winners finals. That was only winners finals. We got we got three more sets to play. Yeah, three more sets at and least. Got, and man, I am so anticip. I am waiting in anticipation to see who is who fights Crocs and Socks in grand finals. Yeah, who is gonna take? Who's gonna try to take this man down? Who wants to fight that caged animal? All right, but. Before we uh, get into Kadako versus Peppery Splash, we do have some advertisements coming your way. Make sure you uh, watch them and help us support this show and help uh, keep the show running. Welcome back. Uh, now we have four remaining players. And uh, right now we got uh, Kadako versus Peppery Splash in Loser's Semi, trying to see who gets to play against Fu in Loser's Finals. Yep. The, the 
I believe Seoul Japanese representative in uh in Guilty Gear or yep. Exert today. Yep, Seoul representing uh that, that I'm aware of at this bracket. Yeah. Uh Nay versus Venom. And it's gonna be a first to two. Uh this matchup, I believe, uh Nays do not like it. I yeah. Uh, Nays uh, I was talking to Bondrin actually about this matchup earlier today, and mm -hmm. it, it's he acknowledges it. It seems kind of evenish, because if May is right, May is really May is right. May is really right, and Venom with no defensive options has to really eat everything May dishes out. Yeah, and she has incredibly strong Oki, um, but at neutral, you know May likes to be in the air a lot, and Venom has some of the strongest anti airs in the game. Almost certainly, and great in neutral as well with the ball, so it can be annoying to try to get in. But it definitely is one of those matches where maybe you know both characters are really, really apprehensive. Yeah. I mean both care both players here are just opting to go to full screen, but Pepper Splash has now got the setups. Yep. I mean May also does not have a deep here or anything like that. But she also has to pretty much deal with whatever Venom's throwing at her yep. in the corner. Oh, oh my god, big counter hit on the JD. JD? Alright. Pepper Splash confident just runs up throw. Yep. Got him with the Ooh, overhead. Man. And something I actually I was talking about with the Kase is uh, it's kind of hard to run Nick and May sometimes because she's so short. Yeah. If you're going to do like the late air dash stuff, you have to really do a really low air dash. Exactly. So you see right here, uh, Pepper's actually often do just some simple falling normal stuff. Mm -hmm. Exactly. But now Kadako has the corner position. It, as Kadako, this is going to be really hard. You have to play this quite literally perfectly. Yes, you can't take any chip. However, he does have a lot of meter here. Oh, but... he did my spinetium at Tefty. Nope. <laughs> and yeah, the speed at which that happened, Pepper just woke up 2S Stinger. Yep. He's like, whatever this is, it's not real. I'm mad now. Yeah. Oh, oh man. My God. Yeah, that is not uh, far slash and IED. You can try to get a reset there, but it's not ever going to combo. Oh, the my God. First, he teleported into, into it. it. <laughs> oh my god, tries to double head Mormon. Oh, and there's the 6P at work. And man, again, he's. What he is this damage? This, this is a lot of damage. Wait this, a minute, this is Venom. I thought this character did no damage. <laughs> and now this is gonna do a lot of damage on block. Oh, oh I'm hit too. And chipped out. Oh my goodness. He was trying. If he could have reached, he could have hit uh, Venom. And I think he's involved for that animation. Yeah. So he could have through the Dark Angel. Yeah, but, really tried to Hail Mary through it, but Kadako doesn't get it. And Pepper, he just kind of steamrolled that last round. Yeah. Like, he, he heard us talking about like Venom doing no damage and said, let, let me show these let commentators how wrong they are. Let me show you why Venom is top tier. Because many people even put this character in top three. Yeah, for a good reason. Yep. All right, empty low. And the 2D is going to go through the burst. Yeah. And now this is really where Venom really gets started. Instead of the balls, instead of the zoning patterns, oh, but he's going to get anti-air. That uh, has an interesting anti-air hitbox. Upper body involved. All right, but a knockdown has all the orb. Oh, you saw that it was super, it was super wire C. Yeah, okay. Kadako using this interesting tech of wire seeing your super so early that you only spent 25 for it. Yeah, all right. And you get the invul. You, yeah, but you do get the invul. Until you try to wire C, which is why he is now in the corner because the wire C got hit. Yeah, unfortunate. And now Pepper Splash is on set point. Yeah. Man, so Kadaka's trying to use these crazy gambits to escape stuff. Shows he's actually really worried. Yeah. Um, his track record against Venoms in America, not the greatest, because he did uh, lose to Takanase at Frosty this year. He did. It was quite the upset. He was the number one seed in that tournament. Uh, Kadaka was, and Takanase just took him out. And now Peppery kind of giving him trouble as well. Yeah. I mean, so far, Pepper has such a massive life lead, but now you at one bad tech button. But oh. as I say, this the blitz is about to turn the uh, favor again. All right, see if he can get neutral back with the ball, oh, but uh, Pepper removes it. Yeah, Pepper having such a great opportunity to uh, take it out has so such low committal projectiles. Yeah, man, Kadaka kind of seeming lost in neutral right now. Doesn't know what to do to get in. This isn't gonna be a knockdown. It's a ah. bit of damage, but again, you're in the scenario where and you need to play perfectly. And you're out of meter, and there it is, the double head morbid ball hit covering the ceiling. Yep. Uh, double head morbid ball hit also was the interesting property of if you hit Venom, the ball does not go away. Yeah. 
All right. Ooh. Every answering that uh, he can indeed beat Kadako and now has to fight Fu in, yep. in Loser's Finals. We are back to the land of first to threes. But good stuff from Kadako coming all the way here from Japan and getting fourth. Oh, most certainly. These, this man has had it for so, like, he's had that skill for so long and he's still got it. Oh, yeah. Coming out all the way from Japan and playing in one tournament the entire day. Yeah. Uh, too, he's in plus R too. Oh, he's in plus and R. He's going to definitely kick ass in plus R. Oh, well, certainly. That man is even better in plus R than he is in Xer. Yeah. <laughs> All right, but right now we got a, a yeah. pepper splash of Foo. Going to be yeah. loses finals. Speaking of multi game specialists, we also have Foo. Yep, actually, both of these players. So there was uh, one tournament, I forget what it was. Peppery Splash, it was a major. Peppery Splash got top eight in all three Guilty Gears. Okay. Got top eight in Extra, top eight in Plus R, and top eight in Strive. Okay. It was, I think it was like Combo Breaker or Evo or something, but it was. It sounds like it, Combo Breaker to me. Yeah, it was insane. But Fu also, Fu will go to a tournament and he'll just have four medals around his neck. He's like, yep, that's yep. just me. That's just me. <laughs> and then and those, they won't all be even fighting games. They'll be like Yu Gi Oh! Yeah. Magic. Yeah, I think at Slashback, he was. In top eight for DNF while he was uh, qualifying for top eight at uh, an Exude. Mm -hmm. The multi game specialist here. Okay, we're going to have uh, Venom versus Heyun. Pool player versus girl in a robot. Yeah. And I, so again, Peppery Splash up against that. An incredibly high damage character. Does not want to make a mistake. Yep. Lest you lose 70% of your life. And especially in this matchup. So again, we're talking about Shinken. Venom has a lot of like long pokes, but they kind of have some issue with low profile sometimes. Yes. And a, a move like Shinken, if it counter hits you, you can just Licky Kiss Goodbye to half your life bar. Yep. And Ooh. it's going to end in a knockdown, which will be another mix up, yep. which could be into another Shinken, which will probably be the uh, another 20, 30 percent. Yes. And then the next mix up will probably kill. Okay, good blocks here. Trying to keep the pressure on. Boo, life whittling down. Yeah. But the dead angle out. And, and there it is, the Shinken counter it. You but, thought it was your turn? But Peppery finding the burst point. Okay, blue kick. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, had the wire. See, man, Peppery shutting down all the shenanigans. Yeah, that's going to be a really rough thing oh, in the matchup, yeah. is that uh, uh, Stinger is so good at deleting the uh, blue and orange projectiles, yep. or at least, the, at least the blue projectile. And orange projectile takes too much time in order to set it up. Exactly. Oh man, great tick throw. Yep. What's the mix? Now we're just gonna go for chip. <laughs> Keep preventing the jump out. Oh, he's yeah. just playing it safe. I'm not gonna even mess with Shinken over there. Nah, oh my god, bishop run, out. bishop run out, bro. He's got the bro on lock. Now it's behind him. But All right, that's... didn't do too much work. Yeah, Pepper getting clipped by a 6 H. You, you, you're starting to see there's a lot of, there's a lot of supers. He doesn't use them most of the time. He usually no. just uses one, Dark Angel. Yeah. And you'll see a lot of Venoms usually spend their meter on stuff like Stinger YRC. Yeah. And the Fire Slash, one more hit. Wow! That's plus. Oh, oh nice blitz. blitz. Yeah, take that uh, opportunity to Blitz and then 6 uh, p He was so smart. Yeah, so he Blitz, got the invul, and then he did the one move that would low profile the orange ball. Yep. So he could actually fight back. Man, Brown's our carcass. Oh my god, great link there. Yep. And again, uh, Fu, hailing oh from goodness. SoCal, should, has a lot of experience in the match of fighting Hirsch. Yes. We'll see how well Hirsch has prepared Fu to uh, fight Peppery Splash. Yeah. But man, looking really good for Peppery oh Splash my so far. Goodness. Working Bravo on seven goals and letters. It, you know, Hayden has a really big body, so it's really hard for her to get out of pressure springs like that. Exactly. Uh, okay, oh, good IB throw. Yeah, she has some tricky movement with air Hayabusa kick, but if you're ready for it, yep. you IB it, you will get a ground throw. Oh, man, yep, he's too big. And the 6P, good confirm. 6P is jump cancelable. I think like a lot of them forget about that. Oh, my oh, goodness, 6H counter hit. And man, Fu is stuck in the corner again. Dead angles out for Fu. Here's the tech throw. This is exactly what you need. Good blocks. Now in the throw. Man, yeah. Look at this chip. Look at it. It's so much. 
Oh. <laughs> and Fu was trying to hold on to as much meter as he could. Yeah, but you really can't. When the chip is that high, you have to have P to save yourself. At least some of it. Yep. Heaven or hell. Duel. Duel. One. All right, Pepper Splash. Oh, the Gambit. I, I think that would have maybe beat 2S. Maybe. Oh, man, what a trade. That was a good trade for Fu. But, oh, this is such a good start. Not Take the burst, wow. and you have the corner position. Oh, the Blitz. He's, he's really got to do all the stops about the anti air. Yeah. Okay, and it's, it's so hard against a character like Venom who has such great anti airs. Oh, okay, but now it's his time. So all the, the damage lead here. Oh, the math. <laughs> Big in four frames, you don't mess yep. with it. When you give them a turn, they're gonna take it. Oh yes, hold down the neutral for once. For five seconds, I get to be the master of neutral. And again, the checks with these two Ps. Yep. You trying to tick throw me? Uh-uh. Nah. All right. And the six, six H, the seven frame five check. Yeah, and if you get counter hit by that, that is going to be a Grandpa Viper into the corner. But now Pepper Splash has got the corner position. Yeah, I think it was a bit of a, a drop that let uh, the Pepper Tech there. Yeah. And look at all this. Oh, like, my goodness. Carried to the corner, got a reset. Now you're stuck in the Dark Angel. Next round, kind of checkmate here. Yeah. That was a one slight error literally led to that round gone. Yeah. But and now... If you consider the resource game, we now have first back. Yep, and Peppery, yeah, Peppery is at set point, though. All right, Fu immediately taking that uh, first advantage, spending it immediately. Oh, man, oh, man. Peppery so ready for anything Fu's going to try. Oh, no. Once again. Oh, my God, keeping the air movement tricky. Oh, this that's a counter hit. Oh, oh reset. Yo, the stun might be on the way. All right, keep him blocking. I got my own Dark Angel. Oh my goodness. Yo, on the fly combos, but ah, uh, this did not work out well for Fu. No. He's getting his knockdown. Oh, and get the oh. fuzzy. And yeah, that'll be it. Oh. Every splash moving on. Yep. Man, that's a tough matchup. You can see Heian's big bias being taken advantage of. Yep. Getting a fuzzy at the end. All right, and now Peppery has battled their way and is now has to fight. The other vampire in the bracket, Crocs yep. and Socks. Yep, and this, funnily enough, this was Grand Finals um, at Combo Breaker, Breaker well, last year yeah. from the other side. Exactly. Like last time, Peppery was one in winners, and Crocs had to reset him, which he did, and then he lost. Uh, yeah. Um, but now the roles are reversed, and now Peppery has to fight for his chance. He has to win two sets. Yeah. He's got to win six games against Crocs and Sox, yep. where Crocs only has to win three. Yep. And it's going to be definitely, it's going to be a battle. Um, this matchup definitely favors Venom. Yeah. But Slayer can make it work. You've seen the damage that Crocs can do when he does Burst Dot. It is nothing to play with. Oh, most certainly not. Yeah. Um, All right, now where did our players go? <laughs> <laughs> you look at the player cam, they're not there. Like, where did they go? Yeah, but man, what a wild ride it has been. You know, both of us, we competed, we, we could not make it. No, <laughs> it, there's, it's a shark tank. Yes. Exert is such a shark tank right now at, at this current point in time. There's like, I think no better time to play Exert. Yeah. There's so many people who want to share with you how to play this game. Mm -hmm. uh, if you ask any of these people who showed up to, to Exert today, they will go on for hours about, it. look, this game is sick. Here's all, of, here's all I can tell you. Just go out and play it. Yep. And big shout outs to uh, Landline, uh, Coquette, Joy, uh, Tay, and like all the all the, oh. the TOs and bracket runners who really helped out. Especially with, them. Yes. like They're the ones who make this happen. Yes. And big thanks, of course, to Evo providing us with the space for this bracket. Yes. Um, we <laughs> we capped out for the bracket really fast. We, we, are, we are the only side game to cap out. Yeah, 128. We'd have, I'm sure we would have had a lot more if we didn't hit the cap, but. It was just, it's a great, great chance nonetheless. All right, Crocs. Crocs is here. Yeah, all right, we got Crocs. Yeah. And uh, Crocs also a relatively young player. I think like Combo Breaker 2022, when he like got second, uh, he was, I think he was only 21 at that time. Mm -hmm. So yeah, definitely one of the, the younger players, uh, younger top players to uh, hit the scene. Oh yeah. Um, 
So Crocs and Zwei are definitely rep reps of the, the new blood. Yes. But all right. And yeah, we're, this could, this will be it. We could see two games or one. Yep. Uh, you know, I want to see as much Guilty Gear as I can. So that kind of informs us of what I want to see happen. Yeah. <laughs> that's, 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 I want to see game 10. I want to see game 10. <laughs> Watching this game at high level is such a, such a, such a pleasure. It's such a blast. All right, and again, Crocs and Socks representing Christmas in August. Pepper Splash with the orange. Yep. Both players red in this red in this rock. Really yep. wants the dramatic. Uh, and, and given the maximum time to think, also. Oh yeah. Let's see what the round start is gonna be. Venom does have the fastest round start in the game. Two S has six frames. Oh, but we got the back dash because yeah. even Two S will have to won't deal well with the likes of uh, Dandy. Yep. But Pepper Splash getting the knockdown here. Oh my goodness, look at the pressure. Yep. But Crocs finds the BDC out. Yeah. Tries to reset with the close slash, but oh, counter there hit. There it is, remember I was telling you, 2D of a whip from Venom, counter hit recovery. Yep. And now we knock him down. Cross him up. Here's all the mix up. Oh my god, Crocs has all this meter. You gotta be mindful of how he wants to spend it. Yep. You, you, he's got burst, he's got 100 bar, you gotta. You gotta be careful. Oh man. Oh, there, there it, is. it is! It hit! It definitely hit! Oh my, it traded! It, but he's, uh, he's, he's fine. Slayer is tanky, it's fine. Slayer is tanky. Venom is not. No. <laughs> oh man, round start dandy pile bunker. All right, taking the opportunity to BDC uh, oh. out. Oh man, empty jump low from Peppery Splash. Here comes the Dark Angel. You try BD saying out of this one. <laughs> and man, here comes another knockdown. Oh, look at all this meter. Are you gonna use it to FD? Oh yeah, he does. Yes. And look at how that meter and he still dies. That's the the false dichotomy that Venom prevents uh, presents to you. Your life or your meter. You know what? How about neither? You're just going to die. I mean we are in <laughs> Vegas. It, we all we all play lose lose games yeah. here in Vegas. Okay, ooh, yeah, empty jump low from Peppery. Oh man, I guess the air dash mix up. Actually, there's a combo there. Oh, great BDC uh, Mappa. Yeah, Peppery just saying, you know, you're, you're just gonna sit there. Really thinking a Slayer was just gonna sit there. <laughs> nice Cross blitz. takes the opportunity to just get out. Fully charged blitz. Full charge blitz is actually uh, unblitzable. So, yep. you ain't fully charged it, you can't blitz back. Yeah, you gotta try to find some other way to deal with it. Yeah. Man, gets the confirm. Sees the standing confirm too. Peppery with the awareness. Oh, here's what? the first knock. No, no, he's ready. Oh, oh it hits, hit, man! And it's just like that. Oh, I don't think he meant to back that like that. Oh man. Oh, oh man. I think he doesn't use the air options he's got. Oh my God, and then Peppery air with throw. the air throw. Yeah. Peppery has been on point with these air throws. Man, that was every time. Like you're a blocker, right? No, I've been no. wrong. I've been wrong every time. <laughs> oh my god, I think he might have just been caught in like the recovery of a, of a of small set. Oh wow, what a cross up. Oh my god, another Man. counter hit. Yep. It's gonna be a knockdown. Blocks the overhead, but it is even on blocks, so it's still not your turn yet! I thought it was plus three. Oh. Um, but the overhead was no, plus three. I think, yeah, I think you're right. Under pressure I, is even, yeah, the, and it's late is plus. Yeah, yeah, I think you're right. Yeah, so if you see like the slash, like the, the swipe upward, that's even. Yeah, but then the downwards hit is plus on block. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Now Crocs were doing a pretty good life lead here. Oh man, that was a basic win. Okay, six ping under the balls, trying to move around. Slayer yeah. with his limited mobility kind of having a hard time dealing with the balls because he has a, just a step dash. And a kind of a short air dash too. Yeah. It's a fast air dash, but it's a short one. Yeah, it's really impressive, or it's really useful in, in pressure, but once you're trying to move and navigate around things with it, it can get real quite hard. Yep. Oh man, nice 5 pm here. And this is real scary. You're not gonna get knocked down by a Slayer with meter, and... He's walking, yeah. you know, he was walking forward because Crocs does his mix-up where he dashes through you, yep. and does burst off, and you don't have 
a chance to react. No, nope. because it's a plus zero super. So you just have to guess. And that is why Pepper was walking forward. It may have looked dumb if you don't know, but we it we know. was not dumb. It was a 50-50. Yep. <laughs> and it's why you, like you see, like, wait, why did he just run up burst or like walk, walk back burst off? It's <laughs> yeah. Like, well, you could frost it up. <laughs> all right, here's the Dark Angel, though. Man, look at all this. Because he has a full screen to work with, there's a lot of chip. Yeah, <laughs> like because he had Dark Angel, he had enough time to set up a level three ball. But Crocs with the crosswise heal. Man, all right, damage equaling out. Off the bike. He has 100 meter. Okay, keeping it safe. Good block in the overhead. Oh, but a big counter on the 6H. Oh, what the? I guess this is confirmed. Yeah, I think he misses confirm. And oh, wow. Yeah, Croc had a really good position there. Kind of yeah. lost it, but is now working to make it back. And that's it. And yeah. here with the 5P. It was really awkward. Um, Pepper didn't really get any anti-air attempts or like air throws, but it was because like, it looked like really hard for him to try to do so with where Croc is positioning himself. Yeah. All right. That's the class. Danger time. Wait a minute. How, how he hasn't seen a danger one? time in this top six. Right. It's about time we it's, saw it's one. It's about time. <laughs> Especially when it's Slayer. In grand finals? Uh. And look at all this damage. Saw the 5D. Pepper taking the burst point. Says, I want off Mr. Toad's wild yeah. ride. Oh, my goodness. All that damage. Like, this is so hard. You Ooh. have 50 bar. You spend it on Sticker YRC. But okay. any random thing that Slayer hits you with, it could be death. You gotta be clean. Gotta watch out for the BDCs. Watch out for the Eternal Wing Supers. Oh my God! Dead okay, angle good out. Angle. Okay. Oh, has to jump out. Get good air throw. there, bro. Man, is he really? He's really clawing the back. Yep. I Man, mean, we, we want to talk about clean. Pepper is really showing that they have been clean this entire oh, tournament. And the double head morbid covering the sky with the ball hit. Oh my God! All right. This is going to be a hard-fought game three. Yeah, you could never count Peppery out. Good throw. Slayer's Dandy is striking bull, but not throwing bull. Yeah, but the BDC Mappa there going to get Crocs out of that setup. Oh, and, nice 6P. Yeah, trying to come down with JD, but Peppery aware. Takes wow. some of the burst. Has 50 bar. Man. Oh, my god, the tension. The, the burst. And the super rocket. Okay, I think he. he, he oh, oh, oh right. he used it. It's a rare sight when you see Crocs burst it. He had to because he was going to die. Yep. He will use it when he has to. Yes. But he'd much rather prefer if he just spent it on burst yeah, on take seventy percent of your life. It. Killing you. All right. Peppery up two to one. Again, he has to reset the bracket before he can have a chance to win the tournament. Yeah. But that's an important game right there. Now Peppery now has a game to play with. Yep. Oh my god, the throw break. Oh man. Crocs being so unpredictable with these dashes. Uh, the air dash is actually, uh, I think, second fastest in the game. I after think so. jams. Yeah. So it is very hard to react to. And, man. Sniper with the air throw. Crocs does have 100 bar. Oh, oh, oh man. Misses the combo, but he is freestyling it right now. But BDC Mappa out. Oh, oh no! Got counter hit. That moment where you miss your throws, like, all right, I'll counter hit this 5 age, I guess. <laughs> we take those. Oh, and now the trip. He has to MD if he wants to stay alive. Look at all his meter. He had so much. And now all of it's gone. Oh, man, all of it. Oh, but the J2K. <laughs> going to counter hit. Bro, the bite. Oh, my God. Hit with a 6 on the ground. He is persistent. Oh, the back of Footloose. Oh, and my the God. 5K. Yo, as David Delos once said, what a great button. Yeah. He definitely puts that long, long leg out there. <laughs> yes, indeed. Okay. Oh, but the 6P. And, and reset him, too. Even in the corner, it will wall bounce, even on non counter hit. All right. Crocs working with a really good lead, but this is not the first time we've seen Peppery claw it back. Good IB close slash there. If you have IB into a five frame button, you can stop the, uh, the under pressure if it's late. Yep. Okay, empty jump low again. Oh man, okay, but he has 100 meter and burst. We know what can happen here. And like, he can burst out and YRC even, uh, RC, yeah. but he won't get a chance. He did try to hold on to all, all of it. He tried to hold on to at least some of his meter. Yeah. All right. And Again, Pepri pulling that back. Yeah. 
Peppering up to not use two S and kind of letting Crops be a little bit friskier around start. Yeah. Oh man. Oh, Good the back, back dash. dash. Not a lot of active frames on that. Uh, it's late. All right, oh. here comes the uh, here comes the Darth Angel. Good luck, uh, BD seeing through this. Oh man. And while oh, you, the ball hit on the mad struggle. Crocs may have lost 50% of his life, but he does have 100 bar. Oh, caught the BC Mappa. Oh, does it cross him up with the crosswise heel? Nice air throw. Yo, he, no, he's spreading the 50 50. Oh, oh okay. no, okay. He's just blocking. He's like, I ain't messing around anymore. Oh, oh my no. goodness. That's the BDC jump that. Oh, man. Yeah, two H's on the low to throw in there. Okay. Oh, man. Another just, yeah. Look, good thing for Crocs that uh, Pepper missed his throw. Uh -oh, he tries to slash. reposition, but Far Splash reaches so far. And that is going to be a reset from Peppery Splash. Oh my god. You can see, so one thing I really like about Peppery Splash's block strings is he's spitting a 2H in there at the end of it, yeah. which puts in another low in there. Yep. So if Slayer tries to BDC a little too early, he'll stand up into the low and get hit. Exactly. All right, but Crocs with a good reversal of fortune here. No, but it gets caught by the wake up throw. Oh. And now you're going to have Dark Angel. Wake up throw is zero frames in this game. It will beat meaties. And yeah, didn't FD all of it. Had to want to try to keep some of his meter here, but you are now stuck in the corner. Yep, you don't you have, have to FD all of this. <sighs> and he gets ticked around. Yep. It's, it was a rough position. And man, now Pepper is splash, having the momentum from the reset. Yeah. In the first round of the second set. But Crocs with a great air dash in early on. Takes to the corner. Not Here's the first. Here's the first bite. Okay. Man, that's a lot of damage. Oh, the throw what? again. The throw. It's like it can't. It beats me if you're too close. And oh, he hit him. He hit him. He hit him. Yeah. Yep. Whoa, I think he missed up the air dash maybe. I don't know, sir. Oh, but oh. tries to be decent Mappa. You have 50 bar. Henry is ready for that. Okay. And he can't splits with the low. All right. Oh, man, cut him with a 6K, 6H. Pepri just using these buttons to keep out Slayer. Yep. All right, second the corner. This is this is exactly where you don't oh. want to be. Nice BDC Mappa. He is persistently using it. He's keeping Pepri Splash on his toes. Yeah, and now gets a BDC throw there. Wow, I, I can't believe that all comboed. Yeah, that's, a, that's wild. Just simply oh. run up. I was surprised okay. that 6K didn't actually cross up. Yeah. Okay, good block. Oh, oh the 2K tick throw. Yep. All right, Crocs gonna spend burst here. Crocs trying to chase down Peppery to the close out this set. He just needs one, one. more good hit. Another good hit. <laughs> Crank some of that risk. Okay, trying to stay, <laughs> trying to keep out yeah, of Venom threat range. Yeah. Oh, and kids up with a JH. The cross up JH. Oh, man. All right. My God, Crocs. Really trying to make sure that's like, nah. Okay, you may have beat me in the reset, but I am cleaning this out. Yeah. I'm showing you while I got here. Yeah, and Crocs, you can see it the way he smiles and laughs. It is very hard to break his mental. Oh, exactly. You, you see the way he plays. He's already, he plays like he has the man that has nothing to lose. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you cannot break this man's mental. And right now, oh my man, goodness. simple one hit into super. Seven golden layers in this matchup is pretty hard to do. Yeah. <laughs> it, it, it can be really hard for Slayer to navigate around the, the projectiles that yep. Venom will put out. Okay, the far slash. Ooh. But man, the tech buttons for Crocs can Firms with a black beat. Yep. Wow. Okay, health is going to get blocked. All right, but now Crocs has put themselves in the corner. Crocs has been hit a lot by the lows in the in Peppery's string. I wonder if he's trying to BDC. Probably. Or Dandy. But man, close with a J2K counter hit. I, mm. Wow, I don't know how he hit that same side. Burst oh, dot. Not enough to, oh! Wait, is it enough to kill? Wait a second. Oh, oh no, it's black, black beat. Oh. Okay, the air throw. Trying to keep a knock down in the corner. Oh, this is dangerous. Oh, oh! tech buttons! And we don't care if we they trade, because when they only need one hit, 
That's all we need. Yep, you gotta keep it clean. And there, we're seeing something here. Playing two sets as Venom is pretty strong. Playing yeah. two sets as Blizzard is pretty strenuous, but Slayer thrives on trades. Oh, exactly. You trade with Pilot Bunk, you trade with Crosswise, you are taking a fat combo. Trade with 6H even sometimes? Yep, or 6P. Yeah, that's gonna hurt. So a, a long set like this can be taking its toll on Peppery right now. Especially with all the adaptation that Croc is making. Exactly. Oh, oh here my gosh, up. yep. And he, he is so... His track record on hitting these is so good. I think he's only missed one. Exactly. And man, Tech JK, this could be pretty big. Yep. Oh my this gosh. Is Has to beat easy no jump. No meter. Yeah. You need meter to air FD because otherwise ground moves are air unblockable. Yep. But uh, Crocs has made like 50% of his birth back. Yep. All right. And man, taking that footloose journey right out of the corner, but immediately goes back into it. Oh. Yeah. Nice smash. Crocs is definitely like, in involving a lot more air movement using yep. J2K and Footloose Journey. He is trying to like, he's staying mobile with name in the game because once you get locked down by Venom, like we're about to see, yep. it is rough. But this is a this is a fine situation. Like oh the even, guts. Pro oh my. Okay. Oh actually no. Wait, don't don't listen to me. <laughs> I thought we had another round to play with. <laughs> no. All right. I was about to say, it's like, yo, it's fine. We made burst back. It's fine. We can be up for round three. No, we don't have round three. No, we don't. Two, one here. Oh, the block the gold, gold burst. burst. Gold burst is safe on block. Whew. All right. And man, Pepper again with a knockdown here. All right. A boarding so we can get out of the corner. Oh, oh right what through. A, no no uh, knockdown, but he'll take the damage he can get. Yeah, Tank to use the J2K. Ooh, I think he missed his air dash there. Or JK, I should say. Covering that suppression. All right. Oh my god, Glee clip from all the way to the screen. Oh, and the beast is getting caught. The last hit of Close Slash. Man, Close Slash is one hell of a button. Yeah, five frames, reaches like super high, launches on hits. Yeah. All right. Peppery is now one round away from tying this up and taking yep. us the final game. Okay. Oh man, the IPs, but doesn't try to throw. Peppery getting clipped by the 2S. Oh, again, the close slide. But Crocs attacking JK. Man, double head more, but oh, the 6H. Yeah, Crocs maybe, maybe getting a bit too uh, antsy with these tech buttons. Yep. Oh, good jump out. JHRC doesn't get a knockdown though. Isle Bunker in, RC crosses Ooh, him up. Crocs getting a knockdown. Oh, good throw. Pepper on point with these throws still. Yep. Captain probably kind of BDC or Dandy. Yep, here comes the level three orb. Pass the burst. Oh. All right. It is final game. Yep. Final game. This is it. Peppery has reset, got himself to this point, and now both players, one more game to win the tournament. Oh my god. And Crocs already off to a great start, gets the knockdown, but again, the throw mash. It's so brave to mash yes. on throw in its late, because its late is throw involved. Yes. And if it counted as you as a big fat ground bounce. Oh yeah. I have died so many times trying to mash throw on that ship. Yep. Oh, the lowest stage. Okay, good punish on the 2D block. Oh, but Crocs with the throw. Oh man. Rising buttons, getting Peppery Slash out of the situation, and oh, now man. pretty good here. Gets the corner. Okay, no burst here. And no tech from uh, Crocs and Sox. Just taking the. Oh my oh, god, the wind it's punish. It's gonna hit. Yep. Oh my god. <laughs> Rocks taking it <laughs> with a burst dot. He knows what he's about. He knows what he's about. He saw a whiff. It's like, it's time. It's time. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. <laughs> All right, the OTG keep him off his feet. Oh my god, again, 50 bar already on deck for Crocs. But man, Peppery is now saying, no, I, okay, I just gotta keep you control. I gotta keep you in the I cage. Keep you under control. Got the Dark Angel, locked the chip. But look at the meter, 100. He, he took all of it. He, he not here, only took it. He, I beat all of it. Yeah, he's like, I want this meter. Oh, but will you get to use it? That's a great question. Now, and me, you gotta FD. I gotta lose all the meter he's got. Oh my goodness, he lost all the meter he just got.
but he made a lot of burst back. But Cleanser with the JT! Oh, okay. man. He's about like one pixel away from burst. This is pretty as, as close to even yes, as we as can, you can get. get. Both players on tournament point right now. This is the time that we were looking for. Oh my god, hit him with the 5H. Oh, oh man. Tried to mop it in, but touch AK. The tension is so thick, you can oh. cut it with a knife. Man, all right, the BDCs gets the foot loose. Oh, Picks up. Beat. doesn't matter, no. Looking for burst, Damage maybe? loss on that. There's the burst for Peppery Slash. Whoa, Blitz, maybe a miss input? Had to be a miss input. Oh, wait, is that wait, gone? It's, oh, no. no, 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 okay. I was about to say, was that a uh, dodge? Oh! oh, not gonna hit though. Okay, he took the corner. Oh, no, oh! he put himself in. He put himself back in. He tried to get him with like a cross up JK, but I don't know if cross up or JK hits that deep. Yeah, and <laughs> Peppery dodging the burst dot for his tournament life. The like one, the the one burst dot to not completely connect whip, completely yeah. connect. Oh, but what a set. Peppery resetting the bracket from losers. Oh my and God. And then taking it in game five of set two. Showing you all why this man is arguably the, the not maybe not even arguably right now, but kind of the best cut, uh, player in the Western Hemisphere right now. Right now, yeah. Clearly the best Venom, clearly the best player uh, at Exert in, yep. in uh, North America. But good stuff, good stuff to Crocs. That was what a set. What, Such what, a set. What set. All of these sets have been yes. like so great. Yeah, this top six was uh, amazing. Um, but yeah, once again, thanks to Evo for giving us the space for this event. It was, uh, it was wonderful. Uh, and really big shout outs to PGG for holding it down. Um, yep. Landline, Path of Flip, Coquette. Um, and thanks a lot to the bracket runners for, for really all the work you do, like helping us helping us run this, this thing. Yeah, it has been such a pleasure getting an opportunity to commentate here at uh, EVO Top 6 for uh, Guilty Gear Exert. And now all we have to do is keep looking forward. There's so many more events on the way for Guilty Gear Exert. Yep, yep. Uh, if you are paying attention to the West Coast, there is uh, one event on the way. Yep, yep. <laughs> Hint, hint. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. We got plenty of Guilty Gear. There's so much Guilty Gear to be played. And honestly, I think there is no other way and no better way to sign us all off. Yep. So I've been uh, Perfectly Balanced. And I've been Aetherbeat. And you know what you got to do? You got to live your life. Or you got to love your life. You got to love your life. You got to be good to one another. And, and you, you got to play, play some goddamn, goddamn Guilty, Guilty Gear. Gear. <laughs> we tried. Uh...